Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to make an APA style table in Word. Um, in my previous one, I showed you how to do it in SPSS, but some of you might not have access to a version of SPSS that gives you that option, or maybe the table that you want to do um, has to be changed uh, significantly. Um, and so you might as well just do it all in Word. So um, for this example, I'm going to use the descriptive statistics um, and do a mean and standard deviation table. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is uh, put the table number and then come up to insert. table, I'm going to have four, nope, uh, by three, doesn't really matter because I can always add or subtract columns and rows. Um, so the first uh, row is going to be um, in italics, mean bands, standard deviation. Um, I'm just, I'm just going to uh, merge the cells. Um, the next one is going to be the column titles. So I'm going to do variable. I'm going to do variable level and then mean and standard deviation. I'm super good at making decisions, guys. Okay, and I'm going to need another row, so we're going to do that. So, my first one is going to be um, high compassion. No, low compassion, that's what the one meant. So low compassion. And I'm going to be looking at the total. Oops. So my mean for that is 335.31. And the standard deviation was 211.14. Three high compassion. That's my two here. And I'm going to look at the total again. Uh, so that's 309.55. The standard deviation was 180.48. And if you haven't noticed, I'm rounding these to two uh, decimals. Then low individuality. And that's going to be this one here. And that's 331.53. And standard deviation is 206.81. And then high individuality was 313.5, and standard deviation is 186.12. All right, so um, it's kind of like I said in the previous video. 
Um, the font that you use in your tables doesn't really matter. Keep it professional, but all of your tables have to use the same font. So in my table one, I have Arial 9. So I'm going to change this table so that it is also Arial and 9. Um, next, I am going to change the borders. So if you look at table one, the borders only go across um, horizontally. So there's no top border above the title. Um, I'm just going to go to borders and shading for this. I'm going to unclick those. Um, the column titles have only the top and bottom. I'm going to make it like that. And then here, for the rows in the actual table, there's no separating borders. There's just one at the very bottom of the table. So and there you have it. Um, I would suggest if you're doing it in Word that you um, change the change the spacing. Um, and just make it more compact. It will help make your table look uh, more concise if you're not taking up the entire page for three columns like this. Um, I would also recommend spacing it out a little bit more like um, table one is. Um, and it doesn't show you what the line spacing is, but I'm pretty sure it is one and a half. Um, so there you have it. Um, that's how you make a table in Word in APA format.